Come on in, let me show you around. What we do here is we teach and we coach, we invent and we build. This is our collaborative space. We have a full media uh, center at the other end, whiteboarded walls. I actually have to stop myself from writing on the walls when I go home sometimes. And there's a lot of coaching and teaching and all of that takes place uh, right in this room. Let's go back here because actually the maker space is where it gets really exciting. So this is our additive manufacturing space. This is where students learn how to 3D print. We also have a vinyl printer and a, also a large scale printer over there in the corner. And basically what you see is printers that can print uh, even at scale but in some great detail. In the future, we're actually going to be having a commercial grade 3D printer donated by CAD Dimensions to the space. So we'll literally be prototyping for local entrepreneurs. We're already talking, for example, with some biomedical and bioscience type startups who need this type of fabrication and prototyping. So it's a pretty cool space. There's an enormous amount of collaboration that takes place among the students where you literally have students teaching students, which is awesome. Let's keep going. Doug, how you doing, man? Great, how you guys doing? Doug is all of this. We thought about how to use every square inch of this facility. We were given the constraints. He worked within these constraints, and so everything that you see here is a result of Doug's know-how and can-do. Doug, thanks, man. All right, take care. So this room is a whole nother industry. What you're gonna see is our shop bot. So you might see some of the wood cuttings on the walls and around the spaces, this shop bot does just that. It runs, it, it does the automated cutting, but it also comes back and you can have a variety of different bits and cuts uh, on the machine as well. We also have a laser cutter. What they allow you to do is a whole bunch of engraving as well as cutting, depending on the different types of materials. This is an example what will be available to those, the grand opening. All right, let's head over to the next room. This is our digital media center. Come on in. This whole space is all designed for optimized video recording. So you literally be able to sit here. You can look at the screen over on the other wall, the clock. Once you create the media, just like the media that you're seeing now, it has to be edited. So we have a full editing corner over here for video. We have a full sound and production corner over here. We also have ham radio. Last but not least, we have our VR and AR. This is literally a device where you can stand on it and you can totally immerse yourself into the virtual space. There's a lot of playtime in this space. It's awesome. And some amazing things have already been created. Let's keep going. Fabrics, prints, embroideries, we have a paint station. We can also do screen printing. There were so many students that were interested uh, in design and fabrics at Lemoyne that we said, you know what, let's do a room for that. And then, as you can see here, this is your typical shop. You can basically build anything you want uh, from all the traditional means uh, that you see and that you know about from high school shop class. And this is the conference room. A lot of people from the community, from the mayor to local entrepreneurs, to investors, to uh, local organizations like Center State CEO, and especially Erie 21. Those are all organizations that have been in this room and met. In fact, this entire building is open to the community. We are a hub uh, in central New York, and we're very happy uh, with how this is all coming together. So that was the grand tour of the Keenan Center. We're making the most out of every square foot we can. That includes not only can-do and building capacity, but just the potential for collaboration.